Here's an interesting neighborhood. I wonder if they make the houses so plain because the rocks are so pretty behind. Maybe, huh? Here's another amazing neighborhood. You'll see why I like my campsite here. You know, the thing I like the most about being out in the middle of nowhere, I like the feeling that I'm not bothering anyone. I'm just living my life, but I'm not bothering anyone. So you can see why I like this campsite. Look here, there's this little dog, a little toy dog hanging in the tree. And there's also a little panda bear. I think it's a ring hanging in this tree. I hope some little kid comes along and finds it, thinks that it's a treasure. You know, I came out here to the wilderness to find myself, and I'm very pleased with what I found. I found an older, wiser version of my teenage self. The Red Rocks of Sedona make me feel very humble today. They're so big, so strong. They've been here for so long. They'll be here far longer than we will be. They just remind me of God's love. The God who created all of this and then created us with eyes to hear all of this. I mean, eyes to see all of this. Well, I think I've said it before, but I'll say it again. If you got to go into town to get gas and groceries, might as well go into a town that looks like this. How do you like this neighborhood? Yeah, people really live here. Now, here's a really interesting thing that I've learned on my trip. I've been going to laundromats, and I don't usually go to laundromats, so here's an interesting thing. Evidently, in one of the washers or dryers that I use today, somebody had a crayon. <laughs> so now I got pink marks all over my white t-shirt. Okay. I'm just having one of those perfect camping moments here in Oak Creek Canyon.
The dogs are all tuckered out. And there's peace in the world. At least my world. <laughs> That's it for today, everybody. Be sure to like, subscribe, leave a comment, ring the bell. And remember, Jesus loves you. This is the year of victory. One of the last things that Jesus said to the people before he disappeared up into the air is, I leave you whole and well. If you can just remember that about Jesus, he has made you whole and well. That pretty much covers it, huh? Pretty much aren't very many problems outside of being whole and well. So we'll see you next time. Adios. Bye.